Hey guys, what's up? D Live here, and I am here with some more wardrobe. We're getting a little bit closer to getting our wardrobe out of this junkyard. Uh, we still need the football player to move it for us, and then I guess I don't know what else we're gonna do after that. First thing we're gonna do is we can now, now, we can now, now, now get the fishing rod prize because we can put the magnet and get whatever we're supposed to get there, which is the only thing that I know that we can do. So we still have these lovebirds here waiting for us to uh, open up the hanky-panky room. <laughs> so now, 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 we are going to cheat this game because it's already very cheap. We're gonna put that on the fishing this is rod. up to be very fruitful fishing, finally. <laughs> yes. Let's go. <gasps> we got them all. We got all the fish. <laughs> What are you gonna do? I can't believe you did it. I did it. I am it. a real pro. What can you do? Why don't you take a look at your pockets? Wait, what? How on earth did you do it? <gasps> you spend your life escaping from the IRS. <laughs> you can't survive without uh, certain tricks. Oh. And how did you end up running a carousel? Social services. <laughs> anyway, with that coupon, you can collect a prize of your choice at the gypsy Ooh. kiosk just outside the city. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. Be careful going around with that other little bag I gave you. <laughs> oh, God. What other little bag? <laughs> I was just oh, joking. What is it? You're not funny at all. <laughs> so he slipped a ticket into our pocket. And now we have more of a map. We have a ticket that we can take to the outside of the city, which I guess is this. All right, let's go see what's, what we what we have to do. What else do we have? In the meantime, oh. Oh yeah, the time machine dude. Oh, he looks really evil. His uh his his thing came, whatever he needed for his machine. Oh. Oh god, his pants are sagging down over there and he's pulling him up. Writer. Okay. A belt would be useful. Exactly. My my point exactly. All right. Hmm. What is it? Postmodern art? Nah, yeah, you're right. I really can't come up with nothing interesting. Like mm. what? Well, bro, I don't know. Something that conveys strong emotion, gets people's attention. Something that grabs you, but original once in a while. Okay. I'm tired of riding a cab on the monuments, yo. You hear me, bro? I'll think about it. Mm. Maybe I'll have a good idea. Sweet. All right. So he needs something. Do we have anything to give him? Don't. Don't really see anything. Hmm, we'll think about that. Maybe we'll get something along the way. Homeless guy. He's a human being. <laughs> Sorry to bother you, but you seem familiar. You probably saw me in a game show in the past. You know, I was a pro gamer once. Oh. Judging by how you're doing now, it seems something went wrong. Exactly. Carpal tunnel. I slowly lost mobility and reactivity. It cut me out of the pro circuit. Damn. I imagine more like an arrow in the wrist or something like that. Arrow in the wrist. Never played Skyrim? Sorry, just beat em ups. Then you suffer the proper punishment. Damn, there's like a, is that a Pulp Fiction reference right there with Bert and Ernie? Pretty sure that is. There's an accordion here, can we take that? For me, it will always be inseparably bound to the perception of two dogs eating spaghetti and meatballs in the moonlight. Ah. Thanks a lot, Walt. <laughs> Walt Disney. Oh, I can't grab it? You should have gathered by now that I haven't got a great feel for musical instruments. All right, well, I'm sorry about it. Yeah, there's where it's Waldo. I just realized there's Waldo. I found him, an old acquaintance. There's Eggos. He probably came all this way just to find some peace. Oh yeah. Well, he's comp he likes the. I bothered him enough. I'll let him rest this time. Whatever wine or beer he has there, he's very happy with it. There's an Eggo box. I doubt the Eggo people will ever stop to thank the Duffer Brothers. I wonder how much they've earned thanks to Stranger Things. Stranger Things. If I were you, I'd let it go. I'm gonna, that little girl becomes a really dangerous cookie I'm gonna when get, she gets mad. I'm going to get yelled at because I don't watch Stranger Things. Okay, I, grant I hear good things about it, though. Malnutrition and baldness, but I'm not the one with the paranormal powers and a strange obsession for waffles. <laughs> waffles are good. Oh, there's piggies. Yo, piggies. I can't even imagine what's inside that slop. Well, piggies enjoy Negative. it. Negative. I'd become a victim of their fury, inevitably. <laughs> and I still care to keep both my hands. <laughs> What do you think I am? I don't know. You nice want to know what's mush, in it. Hey, little pigs. You wanted to know what's in it. All right, so we have this over here, a haystack. Exactly like these things are really supposed to happen. There's like a, a gypsy here, but it's a... What the? A puppeteer? 
He's got no head. I'm so confused. Holy shit. All right, what do we get? In this video game, some phrases are a bit too literal. I got a... Did I get a needle? Also, Assassin's Creed. Right there. Uh, a pin. <gasps> Wait, a voodoo doll. Can I do something with this? Thanks. This thing was really getting under my skin. Yes, well, <laughs> you know. Oh, shit. What? There's something I'm not getting. It doesn't work. <gasps> oh, don't we have to do something with the voodoo doll? We have to put it in that, um... Like, do a, like a, a not, not an experiment, like a, not a seance, like a demon thing. You gotta put it in that pen, that star thing that was in the one guy's, uh, the guy that we knocked out with the shovel, his little trailer. Can we talk to him? Hey, talk to me. Oh, she wants to be I talked to. I suppose I should ask her for my prize. Okay. Um, hello? What's with a concerned face? You never saw a puppet before? Sure, but not one handled with invisible strings by a headless puppeteer. Exactly. And able to speak, by the way. Do you have a problem with me not being controlled by strings? Well, N no. no. And maybe it's illegal for a puppet to have a nice voice like mine. Th that's not what I meant. You women are really impossible. Whoa. Sorry if I insist, but I really don't understand if you're a puppet or a flesh and blood person. Real or puppet? Who cares? I Is care. it just our appearance that makes us what we are? No. Well, I'm a skeleton exactly because I'm dead. <laughs> How do I get my thing? Oh, do I I have to give her the ticket? Gotcha. I was like trying to I like I want a coupon at the carousel. Yes. Choose your favorite prize. Ooh. Anything? Anything. Anything. Lego set of the Millennial Fa Millennium Falcon Ultimate Collector's Version, Detective Comics number 27, E.T. video game for the Atari, poster of the movie M Metropolis, legless amiibo of Princess Peach. I think I gotta go with the Millennium Falcon, come on. I'd like the Lego set of the Millennium Falcon, Ultimate Collector's Version. Hmm, I gave out the last one just yesterday. Fuck! But you're in luck. I can give you this. What can you give me? A little present. But what is in this little present prize? What do Let's I do? Let's have a look. How is it possible that all this stuff could fit inside such a small package? It's like a, a metal head starter kit? What? And a video cassette. There is a, a slot in the crane that we put that in. I think it was a video cassette thing. Metal head starter kit. Didn't we have, didn't the dragon say something about the clothes that he was wearing? So maybe we can get him to sing, because we like metal, right? Maybe, I don't know. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. All right. So there's a cookie there. Can I have the cookie? <laughs> All right, so the cas video cassette should go in here, right? Nice, all right. Ah. This is a cool track. I've never heard it. Too bad I don't ah. know the title. Okay. So there's some uh, metal music. We wanted to hear that. What does that do for us? Okay. It definitely goes here. Okay. We can't take it, so I guess we got what we coming for? Alright, so now... If we take this. <gasps> yes! Not bad. Now you really have an aggressive look. I have to admit it, I'm really pumped for it. Do you think you can <laughs> sing a metal song now? Which one do you want to hear? Ooh. Plums and Roses knocking on Ronald's do door. Do you know Knocking on Ronald's Door by Plums and Roses? Mm, I don't think I've ever heard of it, sadly. But the title reminds me of something. Hmm. Guns and Roses knocking on Heaven's door, and we got Bond, Bo Bones Jovi living on a wardrobe. Do you know "Living on a Wardrobe" by Bones Jovi? I know the band, but not that song. Damn it! Steppen Hut, born to be rot. Do you know "Born to Be Rot" by Steppen Nut? Never heard of it. God damn it! Skinny goes to Hollywood. The power Do you know of death. The power of death by Skinny goes to Hollywood. Wasn't it the power of love? That was a song from the Back to the Future soundtrack. Ah. Humming vi Oh! The Humming the vi Video Cassette song. I don't know the name okay. of it, but do you know a song that goes like this? Oh, yeah. 
Yes, I get it. I love that song. <laughs> oh, is he gonna sing Are it now? You ready? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> He's freaking the cat out and the guy. Oh no! He evicted him. Oh! <gasps> That's his inspiration! And there's also Spider Man was in the audience this there. This time I really messed up big time. Oh fuck. They just sat there, Pyromaniac. They just sat there and watched. Oh snap. So now we can go, right? And go to the outer limit, city limits, and he should have drawn. Some Wow, that's pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. There's a spray can down here that I think we can take. The writer must have forgotten this. Can we grab it? So we got some spray cans, so that's what we had to do there. All right, so we also have the, the time machine guy we still have, but also we have an area in here that we have to go into. There's like a, is it called a pentagram? I think this is a pentacle, a pentacle. Okay, a pentacle. Can we put the doll in there, the voodoo doll? Yes! Okay, negative thoughts. Negative thoughts. Oh yeah, that's why we had to make negative thoughts and put them on the doll. Oh, did you see the candles? Whoa! <gasps> He's got sunglasses. Nothing easier, all because of how easily I can project <laughs> my complete hate of other people. Damn. All right. It's the foot. Is that the football dude? That looks. Doesn't he have sunglasses on or something? Is that supposed to be the football dude? All right. So now can we put the pin in him? Let's just hope this is the right time. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's Johnny Bravo! See you later, Johnny Bro. His face. The guy that was puking. Nice. So we can, oh, that's right, we can get rid of, we can get our wardrobe. Is that really all we have? We have so much stuff left. Okay. I mean, I think we can get our, can't they carry it for us? To Ronald's house? Or do we even know where Ronald's house is? Cause now these guys can finally go inside and do hanky panky. Oh, he doesn't have sunglasses. I don't know who that was referencing. They have sunglasses. All right, let's talk what to him. What do you want? I solved your problem. The bedroom on the upper floor is empty now. The bedroom on the upper floor is empty now, as promised. <laughs> really? Her face. I'm calling my gang now. Be still her. Be still her? What? Take the guys and go to the dump. <laughs> don't waste my time. I don't care what you do now. Damn. It's all fixed. Go now. Anky Panky Room is ready. Look at her face, Jesus. Oh, they're gone. Holy crap. Wow, they couldn't control themselves any longer. All right, sweet. So now we can go and get our, uh, our wardrobe, right? So that's back at here. Oh, he sent his goons. Look at that guy with the, the big, the lanky, the short. <laughs> that's kind of funny. Can I just look at the short dude? There must be a serious lack of good players in this city. <laughs> it's pretty messed up. He looks like the school bully who always pounded on me. And he's pretty fucking stacked. He's got a small, tiny head though. Somebody here seriously needs some Xanax. Okay, can we talk to these guys? Let's go with the short. It's all ready. We can get started. Where do you want us to take it? Friday oh. Avenue, number 13. Do you have any idea how far that is from here? Damn. We're heading to the party. The best we can do is take it over there. I'll settle for that. Okay. Do you hear that? Let's move. All right, they're bringing it. There they go. They're bringing it to the party. I guess it's out of the dump, and that's all that matters, I guess. All right, sweet. All right, so we should be able to, should be at the party. We need a key, or we need a coin for it to be picked up though. Moving this is proving to be much more difficult than I thought. So there's still more stuff. Oh, they're here, the football players. He's itching his ass. 
Thanks, dude. Appreciate that. So we have a spray can absinthe. Oh, yeah, that we, we have the time machine, dude. I almost forgot about him. He is over here. We should be able to go do something now. This is going a lot better than it has been. It I used to get stuck. Finally arrived. Yes, let's go talk to him. Let's go talk to the scientist, dude. We're gonna go back in time and do something. Is everything working, is everything now? working now? The courier took a little convincing, but in return, the carburetor was p perfect. P perfect. I absolutely offer myself as a guinea pig to test it then. Damn. Really? Have you got any idea of the possible side effects? I mean, Time I'm dead already. Paradoxes, inability to come back. Risk of incest with his own mother. <laughs> possible annihilation, chromosome mutations. I can go on for hours. Damn. Let's say I've got nothing to lose. Yeah. It's okay by me then. There's only one problem. Okay. I finished all the plutonium. Damn. And it'll be a couple of days until my trusted dealer can find some new stock. So you'll have to wait. Guess what? I have some, man. I'll come back later. See you I then. I have some plutonium right here, dude. Maybe this might be interesting for you. W where did you find that? Here and there. Okay, okay. Pour in exactly the three milliliters for every d dozen years you want to go back. Okay. Add another t two milliliters to run the machine and one milliliter every half hour of real t time utilization. Be what? as precise as possible. Okay. Okay, no problem. The m machine will start as soon as you have inserted the d destination date in the appropriate d display. Where are we going Avoid back to? traveling into the future. The process p partly uses the geomagnetic field of the Earth and possible changes could stop you from c coming back. Just Ooh. remember, you c can't jump from t time to time. Every time you're forced to return to the present. Will okay. you be much longer? The d doors <laughs> are God. automatic, so Jesus. stay in the vicinity. Some animals could enter the machine and c come back instead of you by accident. Oh, and damn. remember to be c careful to never he would have interfere to stay there. with the space time time continuum. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, whatever. Exactly. Don't worry about How it. How much plutonium did he say I have to pour exactly? Three. Mm. I completely well, forgot. Abound. What's the worst that could happen? Are you just gonna dump it all in there? Okay. Oh, we got an empty container back. Yeah! Uh, yeah! Okay. We're going in. Destination? We can't do anything with that. Do I put a year in? Let's go back to the year I was born. I don't have any reason to visit this age right now. Oh, okay. So I guess we're... Can we just go? 1863? All right. I guess we're going to 1863. I don't know if that was right. Whoa, it looks a little different. There's a sandcastle back here. <gasps> Togepi and Pichu eggs. Is that Juman? That is Jumanji. Jumanji, a game for those who seek to find a way to leave their world behind. Yeah, let's play it, man. Surely life in the wardrobe ain't easy, but it's better than living in the jungle. Jumanji's awesome. I'm almost tempted to leave the first roll of the dice to you. I would totally do it, dude. It's still a five or eight you're hoping for, isn't it, Robin? Ah, oh, man. Robin Williams is awesome. Makes me sad. Knowing that he's gone. The movie is like one of my favorites. There's a fishing net here. I think I see something that glitters in the net. Ooh. What do we need? Oh. What did we just do? We just... What? Serves me right. Next time, I'd better mind my own business. I just jumped in. Can I grab something out of it? Catching it fresh is okay, but that's a bit excessive. Is there not something shiny in there? I've never been a big fan of fishing. Okay, can we talk to the Nobody fishies? Nobody wants to talk to you. <gasps> the fishes would want to. Look at them. They're sad. They want to see me. Good God. Who goes there, prithee? My name is Manny. Manny Calavera. Yeah, I mean, I am the Grim Reaper. I didn't Damn. want to scare you, Mr. Manet. 
Your reputation oh. precedes you, you know. Well, you flatter me. <laughs> but now, enough with the pleasantries. That's not why I'm here. Oh. I guess my time has come. Correct. But not entirely accurate. I could give you a second chance. Damn. Anything. But spare my life. I beg you. Add me to your painting, then. In the sea, possibly large and highly visible. But that's a preposterous demand. It would be completely disproportionate. So we're Not adding ourselves to the it painting. Would absolutely ruin the scene's pathos. Oh, I'm sorry. Do I take that as a no then? Forgive me, Grim Reaper. You'll have your wish. Oh damn. Art burst. So apparently we're gonna be in a painting. I don't know why. <gasps> Wilson is in the corner. I didn't see him. Wilson. Hi. How's the progress on your painting, Monsieur Monet? Totally ruined. No. Sorry, what? Nothing, nothing. All right, do we have to wait here or do we go back? I guess we're going back? I don't know if I'm doing this right. I guess it'll let me go if I need to go. Yep, we're going back. So we did whatever we needed to do. It just says back. All right, so we might have to use this again then. I'll come back later. See you then. A apparently, we can do it again, but we're almost out. Residue? Absence. What? Not that it was a joke before, but now it's really a code red. Spiked absinthe. Okay, so I don't know what that's for, but I just figured something. And also, the, the beach ball is back to being, or the volleyball is back to being normal. <laughs> it's not Wilson anymore. That's why I didn't notice it. Oh, damn. They threw all their stuff off. Be quiet or my husband will hear us. All right, calm the hell down, bird. So now we have this. It's the most sought after room of the party. Not that's for sure. Stuff. There's no paintings here. There's a bunch of paintings, but. Venom. Oh, look at that. We're there. We're in the picture. Why are we in the picture? What did that do for us? Is there something in the room that's different now? I don't know. These are the moments I resent not having a bladder anymore. <laughs> it would be better to collect your thoughts before acting once in a while. I don't know. There's got to be something in here, right? Is he Oh, their stuff's gone. <gasps> They're gone. The door is open. Whoa. What the fuck? There's a big Chucky doll. Oh, wow. <laughs> that dildo. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Hidden lover. There's still someone who insists on playing hide and seek? Certain people just don't want to grow up. Can what are you doing hiding down there? How do I put this? I may have gotten myself in serious trouble. Oh. Who exactly is looking for you? This room is a continuous coming and going of couples. Actually, everyone. Is it Cupid? Let's just say that I've screwed up a bit too much recently. Ah. Oh. You have all my respect. <laughs> okay. Can we grab the sheet? Oh, we took the red sheet. I don't know why. God, do we actually have to... <laughs> Look at the rabbit dildo? Further proof of the high esteem the fairer sex holds for rabbits. Okay, can we... Cool your jets. I'm sorry, I thought maybe we had to pick it up. Oh my god. Is that... Gross! <laughs> I don't know, dude. This room. <gasps> rings! Wait, do we need rings for something? I don't know what we need rings for, but we just got a bunch of... Love letters. Somebody's getting married, and we just got wedding rings. A red sheet. I don't know what that is for. I guess we look at uh, Chucky here. He's even scarier life-sized. Yeah, he is. I'm afraid the opposite could happen. <laughs> I like to be hugged. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Charles, but you can't just add me to your collection. The perks of being already dead. Yay, so then why are you scared? All right, so we have a wig here. Sometimes the best thing to do is not ask any questions. Can we grab it? The color would match the one on my sweater, too. Yeah. I'm obviously joking. Forget it. <laughs> All right, uh, what else do we have here? I don't think there's anything else for us in this room. I'm missing something. Or I just don't know what I'm doing. Huh. Alright. Give me a second, I'm gonna figure this out. 
Okay. Apparently, we have to go back and talk to the zombie and get bubble bath from him. And then I guess maybe that's our way to get into the bathroom. Also, also we can take the plate that's here. So I didn't know that. So that's a good thing that I looked at. I would have never gotten that. So I think we can talk to him. Maybe not. Oh, oh God. What's that terrible smell? You must absolutely take a bath. Grab <laughs> this. Damn. There we go, okay. I would have known that, thank you, I appreciate it. But now we should be able to go up here and do something with the bath soap, maybe? Do you need some more bubble bath by any chance? Be I have quiet. a bottle of it here oh, with me. My husband will hear us. Okay, you can go in. Yes! Okay, so we get, whoa, hi. You can lay it down on the bubble bath shelf. Okay, he's got a lot of bubble bath. Hi. Can I talk to him, fat the guy? The character designer of this video game must be slightly obsessed with robust personas. <laughs> oh, he just went into the water. Goodbye. Is he hiding from me? What? Oh. Well, hi. Can I talk to you what now? What are you doing locked in here? <laughs> I'm enjoying some well-earned rest. Oh. I work as a security guard at the city museum. So okay. situations like this don't come around that often. Luckily, Ralph, my cousin, hates Halloween and offered to cover for me. Oh. A security guard for the museum is really necessary on Halloween night? Yeah. That's what I told the union. But do you think they listened? <laughs> anyway, take this. To repay the favor of the bubble bath. Oh, yeah. It's a bit wet. I don't so even want to know where you kept it. Oh, damn. What is it? A pass. A museum pass. The museum is closed to the public, but you can enter with this pass if you find yourself in that area. If Sweet. You go, let me know if that midget has everything under control. Wow. Dude, calm down there. All right, so we have a new area, the museum, which we can check out probably next episode. Let's check it. Let's uh, look at all this stuff. What is this, tarp? Well, it's water resistant for sure. Can I grab it? Not before he's done with his bath. <laughs> It would be perfect for the wardrobe packaging. <gasps> oh, so we can come back here once he's gone and he's away. Um, we can take this off and use it for the packaging. Aha, uh -huh. that's good to know. Salts. Someone should really tell him not to use all those bath salts. I know people get a little crazy with that. Can it's I grab it? where it is. Okay, so I can't grab it. What other stuff are here? What is this, turn? It wouldn't be very polite emptying the water while he's still having his bath. <laughs> Probably not. So his name is Bruce, apparently, or whoever owns this house is Bruce. Uh, there's a poster up here that I like, ETP, extra toilet paper. Oh my God, his adventure on earth. All right, so we got a selfies here. The best way to attract likes on social networks. <laughs> Can I grab Maybe them? Maybe you're used to this, but certain self-gratifying practices are not my thing. Mm. Let's just say my soul is not the only thing death took from me. Ah, ha, ha, ha. I say open. What's in here? Makeup remover? Okay, so we got some makeup remover. Anything else in there? Nope. All right, we can close it. We have a, a do-it-yourself razor. What? And here I thought you were the only one with such a low IQ. An idiot, it says. I, I don't want to risk cracking my phalanges. <laughs> I am pleased to note that you are intent on proving your superior stupidity. I was just trying to figure out what this is all about. doing robotic voices too. Admit it. You were just calling me an asshole, now you want me to admit it. There's some First soap. First rule for good personal hygiene, never neglect your own personal hygiene. Oh no, I've seen what happens in jail. <laughs> It wouldn't be a bad idea, but first I have more urgent things to think about. Oh, so we have to do something to do. What does that say? Number one rule? That's, so soap is something interesting that we might have to deal with. There's a fish in the soap, a fish in the toilet. The revenge of millions of goldfish ruthlessly flushed down the toilet. <laughs> I mean, I usually they're right dead. I putting it back in a glass bowl. I mean, I wouldn't put it back in there with those hungry ass piranhas. And there's a nose dripping on the wall, which is pretty gross. Why don't you sit on it? <laughs> I can't. I'm not in the game, dude. All right. So I think that's pretty much it for this room. So now we have a new area to go in. We've done a lot of cool stuff. We have to come back here for the packaging for the wardrobe, which is pretty cool. 
Um, but we're we're moving along finally. Uh, I feel like today was pretty 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 positive. We had a little place where we got stuck, but I wouldn't have known to go back and talk to the zombie dude. But there's a there's not many things that we have left to interact with. There's very few things. But we did get uh, a bunch of new stuff today. We got this absinthe spiked absinthe a spray can, right? Then we got the red sheet, wedding rings, ancient plate, a pass, and a makeup removal. So we're getting closer to getting ourselves back to Ronald uh, before he's eternally damned. But I hope you guys are enjoying this series of wardrobe. It is a crazy game. It's very funny, but the puzzles are crazy. Like, I feel like we should... It'd be so cheap to get some hints or something like that, but I need hints. Like, this is really, really... Like, it's hard to to play this game be entertaining and also solve these puzzles and i'm not really good at puzzle games but it's really cool i love the artwork and i hope you guys are enjoying it. if you did if you made it this far in the video please leave a like down below i would appreciate it and i will catch you guys in another video bye